What's wrong with being? What's wrong with being? What's wrong with being confident? Oh. Everything okay? okay? It was a rough night. It happens. We were all tired, and I'm just glad you're okay. Thanks for being so cool about it. Cool beans. <laughs> Quilio, too cool hey, for school. There's something over that way. What is it? Some kind of building, I think. Let's get a closer look. How did we not see that <laughs> earlier? I mean, come on. It's the amulet thing. This has to be a place. What is this place? That's what we're trying to figure out. It's the Temple of the Order of the Stone. Yep. That's Lucas, the point. Lucas, are you sure? He's right. Look. Holy crap. Do you think they're in there? Let's go in and find out. Let's just all be careful. Okay. If you spot anything, call it out. We don't have a lot of time. Isn't it weird how dispensers are carved to look like spooky little faces? What do you dispense, little guy? I get the feeling that we don't really want to find out. Get yeah, I get that me. feeling too. Jeez, walk faster. Oh, what was that? That's probably not a good thing. Oh, come on, dispenser faces. I thought we were friends. Run! Yeah, dodged him like a pro. That was actually pretty impressive. We're trapped! We activated the dispensers with that pressure plate. If we can figure out a way to trigger it again, I bet that'll shut them off. There's a crafting table, maybe we can make something useful. Out of what? We don't have anything. All of our tools and materials are back home. All right, everyone, empty your pockets. Let's see what we've got to work with. I have a few sticks left over from building the shelter last night. I've got some flint and a piece of string. All I have are some chicken feathers I picked up after that chicken machine exploded. Well, let's see, I've got some flint and steel, a sword, oh, and some string from a spider that I fought in the woods earlier. String, sticks, flint, and feathers. Okay, so as far as I know, we have two options here. We can make a fishing rod, a bow, or an arrow. Or a bow and arrow, or a fishing rod. Uh, the first time I made a bow and arrow, the second time I made a fishing rod. We are going to do bow and arrow because that is going to be more useful in the long run, I think. So. That's what we're going to do. And now for the arrow. Do this. There you go. That bow and arrow. All right. The Nether Maniacs' luck is changing. Never say that again. <laughs> that was my third choice for a name, because I already picked the other two. This must be their enchantment room. Yeah, perhaps. Doesn't this look like Ivor's creepy basement? Why do you ask? Find Hello, anything Lucas. useful? 
Not sure about useful, but definitely interesting. There is a lot of history in this room. That there is. See you later. <laughs> Ooh, the book. The battle was fierce, but the Order of the Stone emerged triumphant, saving the land and ensuring that peace and prosperity would reign forever. Well, not exactly forever. These five, five members, five friends, together would give so much to gain their rightful place as five heroes. They would author their own end. They would slay a dragon. Ivor was a member of the Order of the Stone? The stories never mentioned him. This is so crazy. This this explains explain explain why Ivor had such a grudge against Gabriel. They lied to us. They lied to the whole world. Why would they do this? Man, I can't believe you punched a member of the Order of the Stone. This is so <laughs> crazy. The Order might not be what we well, thought I'm they so were, glad I did Petra it. is still out there. That monster is still out there. No regrets. Jesse's right. We need to focus on what we came here to do. Where do these stairs go? Uh, someplace safe, I hope. Or just silence. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I love my face as I walk up the stairs. It's just so plain. It's like... Now this is cool. It's really funny. Wow. What happened to the walls? More like what happened to this whole place. This must have been where they met. That Magnus blew so it up. So where are they then? Gabriel said that once we find the temple, the amulet would lead us to the Order of the Stone. Well, what are you waiting for? Pull it out then. Is something supposed to happen? <laughs> I love the smug look on oh, my face, like, I did it. Yes. There's got to be something we're missing. Look around and see if you can find anything. Bam. Wow. <laughs> Go in circles. Alright, let's talk to some people before we do anything else. What you looking at? Nothing. Whatever. Axel? I was just trying to figure out where Petra might be. I mean, I know she's gonna be fine, but I was just curious. We're gonna find her. Who do you maybe like Petra Axel a little bit, maybe? <laughs> Lucas is just over here. No sin of Find anything interesting in that book? The Doubt only it. thing I found so far is that the amulet was used to track the positions of the members of the Order. And does it mention how? It's less technical and well, more historical. Hey, Ruben. Hey, Ruben, find any clues? We're in the Temple of the Order of the Stone. The Order's actual temple. Yeah, it's Who pretty impressive. Thought, huh? A bunch of small towners like us wrapped up in an adventure like this. Yeah, it's pretty insane. I just hope we all come out the other side in one piece. All right. Pedestal. Boy, I wonder what to do. It's the same as the amulet. No way. It's absolutely incredible. Yeah, it's pretty cool, I guess. How did they build this? Okay. Now I'm impressed. This looks like some sort of tracking system. 
It's the order. It's showing where they are right now. Look, we don't know enough about how this thing works. Maybe the amulet only tracks them when they're on the surface. Or maybe it doesn't work when they're in the nether. We have to go off what we do know. Which is nothing. There are only two lights on that map. If there are only two heroes left, then we know what we need to do. Petra's relying on us. That wither storm is still out there. We know that Gabriel was trying to tell us something. We've got to find the Order of the Stone. Yep. But there are only two lights. There are only two members of the Order left? He said Soren was missing. That leaves Magnus. Or Eligar. Let's head out. I'm not going with you guys. I have to stay here. If I know Petra, she's probably doing everything she can to find this place. She's still out there. She has to be. Just stay safe, okay? If there's even a small chance she's alive, I have to stay. Agreed. Go. Get help. I'm going to focus on making this place safe before nightfall. You do that. This temple is pretty big, though. If we're going to have a chance at fortifying it, I'm going to need some help. If, uh, maybe one of you guys can hang back with me? Sounds like Olivia will have you totally covered while me and Jesse are out finding Magnus. Finding Magnus? You really think that's how it's going to go? We need Eligard. She's the world's greatest engineer. She'll figure out a way to stop that thing. We're trying to destroy it. And when it comes to destruction, Magnus is the master. You're a smart person, Jesse. Obviously, the smart thing to do is to go get Magnus. I don't know which one I want to do because I've done both. <laughs> I think Axel. First, I went and got Elgard, and then on the another uh, profile, no. I went and got Magnus. I don't think I did. Let's Pretty go get sure Elgard. Axel meant Magnus. Olivia, you and I are going to Elgard. Awesome. Axel, you stay here with Lucas and get the place ready for when Petra shows up. What with that guy? Yes, with that I'm guy. I'm right here. Come on, Axel, for Petra's sake. Fine, I'll do it for Petra. I'll take it. Uh, guys? Whoa. Please hurry. I will. Maybe. Jesse and Olivia return to the Nether, intent on finding Eligard, the Redstone Engineer. And find themselves in a place of mechanical marvels, Redstone rarity. Amazing machines, limited only by the imagination of their brilliant creator. While the great storm grows, consuming everything in its wake. Time is running out for our intrepid heroes. Okay, so one thing that's really cool about this game is that you get to see how your choice is compared with other people's. 38% uh, of people. Alright, I helped Petra. Sweet. Most people convinced Lucas to stay. And 54.6% chose Eligard. Awesome. Me and 63.5% let Ruben get a black eye. Great. The Order of the Stone. Awesome. Well, that is episode one of Minecraft Story Mode. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye. Goodbye.